a long time ago, there was a place called Medtronic Cities. I'm back again with another video about the Compendium Battle Pass and our predictions. So, we'll go to the predictions. We have to start with the heroes. So, we had this for the Manila Major, and I'm doing that one as well. It wasn't the best one. I'm not the levels out of it, but that's okay. So, I made some made some pictures and uh, so I know what they picked then and it's kind of similar right now so that's some way right so first of all most pick hero what will be the most pick hero what will what gets played quite a lot of times um it's a difficult one but uh, it was a disruptor then now it is maybe Ricky could be. I don't think Disruptor gets picked too much this time. Um, let's see. Maybe Carry. Uh, Life Seal doesn't get doesn't get picked too often, so I have to say. Um, I'm thinking now. Uh, Commission, not really. Beastmaster does. Um, I think Beastmaster will be one of the most picked heroes. It was sported in the Manila Major. It still gets played quite some time. Disruptor doesn't really slot up, not really. Phoenix is not, not so popular anymore. So I feel like Beastmaster is a good pick. Then, most banned hero. I'm definitely going to say Io. It was most banned hero in Manila Major as well, and I think it's still one of the Higher win that one. Make it a bit easier on this side. Highest win rate. Enigma and Medusa were on top, so I th still think Medusa will get get picked more than Enigma this this time this games this tournament. So Medusa will be a good one in my opinion. It's if you get on with it, which most teams can, you will win the game nicely. So. Highest kill average. It was a life steal at previous perhaps, or in the middle major. So, um, so okay. Highest kill average was a life steal, which will get picked. Still, I'm pretty sure he was pretty, pretty high at the 8.9 amount. So. Mm, yeah, I still think Life Stealer will be one of those. So, highest assist. This was an AA or a Bounty Hunter. I think AA will get picked more than a Bounty Hunter this match. Um, I think AA is a pretty strong hero, so we'll go with AA. Um, more Zeus, but I don't think Zeus is going to get picked too often. So, AA is a good one. Lowest death average was as well the Medusa, then the Lone Druid, I think again the Medusa, or the Weaver. Um, I actually think Weaver will get less. Uh, I'm not gonna pick the same heroes again. Probably not gonna do the same thing. I think Weaver will get a lower death rate, death, death average, so I'm gonna go with the Weaver, right? Then Lassets. It's well, an alchemist. He farms really fast, and he split pushes with radiant and stuff like that. So, alchemist lost it. The second one was Ember Spirit, which got a really high one. But alchemist will be high cost. Highest GPM is always alchemist uh, if if he's in the pack, right? But normally, once every time he will be played, or three or five times. But pretty sure. This one will always be the highest GPM, so no doubt about that one. So there's uh, easy 400 points. Most kills in a game. There was a Tinker and Ember Spirit previous. Tinker were, was twice in the top three, in the top three. So Tinker will be the one I still think it's viable to play in this patch. Later. This one or 
the Ember Spirit, not so sure. The Invoker, mm, well, it's a difficult one. Tinker or Invoker. I'm still going with Tinker, it's probably the only thing that stands out, it's just spamming his rockets and stuff. So. Then, most losses in a game, there was an Ember Spirit. Or an alchemist, you can choose. Um, I'm going with alchemist again, just in one game, right? So, I think, oh well, Ember Spirit can get way more losses in a game. Maybe Ember Spirit still, yeah. If it get picked, will get picked one, and it will take a long time to do so. Pretty sure it's gonna be Ember Spirit, right? I'm not gonna make these videos too long. So, these are my predictions. But I think you don't have to pick the same, of course. But this is what I think. Go ahead. If you think or if your opinion is, um, maybe your opinion is based on stats, I don't know. But this is what I think. Not, not very sure about all of them. About the iron, I'm very sure. Actually, and this one, I'm very sure. The others are a little bit more tricky, but we'll go with these and I will rock it. See what hopefully, hopefully we get a lot of points. That's for the players to do, right? So that was it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe to see more about the info, info about uh, the compendium, the new thing and stuff. And see you guys. Oh wait, not before we do the outro. So I'm not gonna do the teams, players, and tournaments right now. It's gonna be another video. I don't want to make it too long, and so I have a lot of content to bring you guys in the next couple of days, right? So, see you guys next week.